All right, what's up everyone? Hope you guys are doing good. Hope you guys are doing superb and welcome to the 16th episode of the Survival Let's Play series. Yes, yes. So before we jump straight into today's video, I would like to remind you guys to subscribe to the channel as well as like this video. So it will only take two to three seconds of your time. So please do take the time to scroll down and hit that subscribe button as well as that like button. All right, it will definitely help with the growth of the channel and I will really appreciate it if you guys do so. So today, we are finally, or rather, we are currently at the desert village once again. Uh, I spent some time off camera to head back to the nether to do some street mining for ancient debris. And we actually got a new diamond shovel as well that has enchantments. Silk touch and efficiency 4. Not too bad, actually. Yeah, so I actually managed to head back to base, which is, I think, towards that direction over there somewhere. Yeah, so we went there, we went to the nether, we went to street mine and all that kind of stuff and today what we're going to do is we are going to check out what's in store for us in this village and try to see what loot we can get and we are actually going to head over to the desert temple as well so yeah so that'll be that whoa, whoa almost ran straight into the cactus but yes that, that'll be the two main goals for this episode yeah we've already conquered the village right over there it's crazy like how so many villages are like so close to each other and all that kind of stuff yeah and Actually, we, towards that direction as well, uh, we've got quite a fair amount of ravines. I think we have about four or five of them. Yeah. Is that a rune portal? All right. So that's a, that's a rune portal as well. So we're definitely going to head over there to check it out as well. So, wow. So many things to look out for. So many things to do in this episode. So let's get cracking. All right. First house. Nothing. Okay. <laughs> oh, anti-climatic much, but it's all, it's all good. It's all good. Okay. Going to head up the second house. Should have a chest right here somewhere in the middle or at the top. All right, there we go. And whoa, emeralds. All right, sweet. We're just gonna take that. Uh, we don't need the cactus. We're gonna take the wheat. Let's take the clay ball. Yeah, I think that's all that we need for this house. Yeah. All right, so let's head back down and head off to the next house. So going spiraling down this stairway. All right, next house. You know what? Let's just leave the doors open so that we know that it's done. All right, next house. This one, nothing as well, right? Cool, doesn't matter. It's all good, it's all good. Uh, moving on to the next one. Should we take the hay views? Yes, actually, you know what? Let's, let's do that. Is it, um... Oh, it's the same. Oh, do they go with shovels? So shovel. Uh, it's all about the same, right? Eh... Uh, you know what? Let's just go with the traditional way. <laughs> By feast. All right. Just gonna get this, because we, we can use the... The wheat from the hay bales to do trading it's with the villagers uh, that we have trapped underneath our base. Okay, not trapped, but rather the villagers that we have under our base. So yes, we definitely gonna need that. Um, all right, let's head down. They don't have a bell for this one. Oh, they do. I feel like take. You know what? Let's just take the bell. Why not, right? All right, next house. Let's see this one. Okay, there's nothing. It's just the cartography table. Yeah, next one. Oh, you know, actually, I, I really like the design of these. Wow. It's not too bad. Blast of furnace. All right, cool. Next one. Double door. Whoa. Stone cutter. It's, it's, so, it's so funny because like, because we have like a, a stone cutter, we've got a blast furnace and all the other shenanigans, but the villagers, or rather their traits, they're all farmers. <laughs> so like... What? That's, that's super weird. I mean, I mean, we could destroy a few of the composters to make sure that they they get like a different job scope, but yeah, this is pretty high. Wow, not too bad. Okay, cool. All right, next house. Sure, we've got very little houses right over here. Oh, oh, this is a nice design. Is that? Oh, there's not a chest. Oh, what? This doesn't make any sense. What? <laughs> what are they going to use this space for? <laughs> That's so weird, but okay. All right, uh, more wheat. Okay, I'll take that. Bread. Cool. Ah, pretty nice design with the buttons as well. Yeah. This is a pretty nice village, actually. Yeah. I think this will be the last one. No, there's another one right over here. So let's check this one out. Bookshelves and a lectern. Hmm. Should we take the bookshelves? Should we, should we, should we, should we, should we? You know what? Let's go for it. Why not? Because we could use the books, really. Alright, just gonna let's just take the lectern as well. So that we can make a new librarian in the future. Yeah, I think that'd be great. Can I expand the base as well for the villagers. 
Yeah, that'll be, that's actually quite a good idea. All right, more cactuses and a clay ball. Let's just take that. All right, so I think that's pretty much it. We've got a few horses over in that direction. All right, so now comes the question. Should we head over to the rune portal first or do we head down to the ravines? No, we actually need to go to the desert temple. So yes, let's head to the desert temple right now. Heading down the spiral stairway once again. Uh, eh? Wait a minute. Oh yes, this is the correct direction. I got confused. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. Did we not go to this house? Oh, actually this is pretty nice. With the buttons and all. Yeah, we could actually adopt this in the future. I mean, why not, right? Alright, moving on. Let's go to the desert temple. Which is right over there. It's probably going to take all oh, beat roots. Just going to take it. Is that normal seed? Yeah, we don't need that. Alright, um... Yeah, I think that pretty much sums up this village. Pretty small one. Not too bad. Alright, let's head over to the desert temple. And then we'll head over to the rune portal. And I think we we're going to drop our stuff off back at base. And head back here to the ravines. And I think we should go and hunt for some other diamonds and iron. Because we definitely will need that in the future. So, yeah, why not? Oh, okay. thought it was a ravine. Whoa. A lava pool. Alright, that's cool. Nice. Nice stuff. Ouch. Definitely did not mean to do that. Wow, okay. What's up with the layout of this place, man? Oh, it's pretty dope. Oh, it's a cave system as well. Alright, alright. Cool, 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 cool. Alright, there's a temple. Let's go. The, we should try to aim to come out before night time so that we do not encounter any mobs and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, pretty sweet. Pretty sweet location. Alright, at least this one is not into the ground. Okay, I was wrong. <laughs> it is. Why do we have... Is this... Obsidian? Why is there obsidian here? No. Oh, is there like a rune portal underneath? <gasps> that could be the case actually. But okay, let's not waste any more time. Let's actually start, start heading down. Alright. Okay, we've made it to the entrance. Let's um... Let's just be extra safe. Alright, gonna eat up first. We are gonna light this place up because the last thing I want are mobs to be spawning. Oh, see what I mean? Oh, there we go. Easy, two hits. Let's light this place up real quick. E that should do the trick, I think. Just a little bit more. Alright, cool. Now let's dig down. Um, let's just break that. Okay. Nice. Found it. Easy. Alright, just gotta be extra careful now. Let's break that off. Cool. Alright. Oh, diamonds. Nice. We do not need that pressure plate. Um, we do not need the strings as well. We could take the gold. We could take the iron. What else do we need? Uh, this can go back in there. What do we not need now? Hmm. We need almost every other thing. Gunpowder is fine. We can make some TNT in the future. Yeah, right. Next chest. Respiration 1. Okay. Not too bad. We'll take that. Uh, you can go... Oh, saddle. Nice. Oh, we can actually... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's great. Okay, clay ball. Nah. Oh, no. Okay. That goes. We could take the gunpowder. Actually, do we really need the gunpowder? Nah, we got, we've got the... We've got a farm. Leo 2. Okay. Nice. Alright. We've got three diamonds. Not too bad. Eh, we don't need the rest in here. Yo. Emeralds. Nice. Diamond horse armor. Whoa, okay. That's pretty sweet. Hmm, what can we trade it off for? This. Alright, cool. Now we've got to take the TNT as well, so I'm just going to put the bones back in there. Alright. Just going to take all the TNT. Don't mind if I do. Alright, what needs to go? You can go. Come to me. Is that all? Yes, yes. Alright, now we tower our way back up from here. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's break that. No! You know what? Let's just leave it. <laughs> that was a very weird scream. Or an exclamation, actually. No! <laughs> Alright, uh, let's make our way out. Which is this way. And yeah, it's night time. Alright, so let's head back to the village. Uh, gonna crash there. Skip the night. And we will head over to the rune portal. Once that's done. And yeah, I'll see you guys in just a bit, alright? Just gonna make sure I navigate my way back safely and not drop into the lava pool. Alright, I'll see you guys in just a bit. Alright, gonna oh gonna make our way over to the rune portal. But we're gonna take out this creeper first. 
and gonna just kite the spider. Wait a bit, okay. I <laughs> for a second I thought I was like, I thought I honestly thought I threw my whole stack of torches into the desert temple. <laughs> Why would I do that? Why would I even think of that? That's so weird. Okay, let's head over to the rune portal. I think it's um towards this direction. We saw the go block just now, but um. Yeah, we've got to make sure we find it. Where is it? It's here, right? I think it. I think so. Huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah alright, I see it. Alright, let's go. We could actually link this one up to the current one that we have. Uh, we got to maybe do that in the next episode so that it'll be easier for us to travel from one village to another. Yeah, I think that's pretty dope. And we can access the ravines and whatnot easily from... With that as well, actually, not from that, but yeah, with that. Alright, let's just check our surroundings. Uh, not too bad. It's pretty normal desert stuff, I must say. Yeah. Alright. Nice. Rune portal. It's always good to find a rune portal. Oh, we should actually dig out the obsidian around the desert temple as well. Yeah, I think we should do that after this. Alright, cool. Where is the chest? That is the thing that I'm looking for. We've got a, a eat up first. Alright, let's get cracking. It should be here somewhere, right? Oh, it's always good to have a diamond shovel. All right, found the chest. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. All right, what do we have? Flint. Man, man, mending. Wow. Looting tree. Whoa. Definitely going to take that. All right, we've got to leave some stuff behind. We are definitely going to... You know what? Let's just leave some of the arrows. It's okay, of course, we've got an abundance of them. What else do we not need now? Hmm. Okay, let's change the hair wheel to... Oh no, that might take up more slots, right? Hmm. What can we leave behind? Clay balls? I'm gonna leave that behind. I'm gonna take that. It's gonna take this as well. Oh, what else can we leave behind? Hmm. You know, I'm gonna change the ingots to to nuggets so that we can stack this run on top of each other and uh, I think we've got to leave the gunpowder behind and take actually we don't really need that right yeah we actually we don't really no curse of vanishing no let's just take that can we smelt it down to get more nuggets go nuggets yes <laughs> I'll try and look for the wood nuggets <laughs> all right cool um yeah, I think that's pretty much all the things that we need at the moment. Yeah, all right, cool. So we just gotta, gotta leave this one be. Um, so what we could do now is actually to head back to the desert temple. But uh, we're gonna check around the surroundings first to see if there's anything new or different or, you know, some interesting stuff. Is there another village? No. <gasps> no. Is there a temple? Nah. -uh. No way. Whoa, what are the odds? Seriously, guys. <laughs> this is mad. Okay, cool. We definitely need to link this. We need to link this uh, nether rune portal. Nether, wow. <laughs> we gotta link up this rune portal with the other one that we have back at base. Yeah, that, that's good. definitely gonna be a game changer, right? So it's gonna really help us with the traveling time and whatnot. All right, so um, we're just gonna leave that there first. We're not gonna touch it. We are actually gonna head back to the desert temple over there. And we're gonna dig around and see if there's a, another rune portal. And if there's nothing there, we're gonna head back to base. We're gonna drop off most of our stuff. And yeah, probably head to the ravines and oh, probably head to the ravines and get some diamonds before we end the episode. Yeah, I think that's actually that's gonna be the plan for today. Yes, yes, definitely. Okay, just gonna skillfully kite and avoid the cactuses. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah, I see the I see the obsidian, but. Is it normal for obsidian to form at the surface? I don't think so, right? Hmm. Food for thought. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so really. I, I think we just gotta just gotta dig around. I'm pretty sure that there's something around the vicinity and there's a lava pool right over here as well. So we gotta be extra careful of that. And I think one of the rabbits just jumped into the lava. <laughs> uh the wonders of nature. Alright. Yes, I was right. Whoa. Really, guys? Whoa, this is mad. Guys, this is crazy, I'm telling y'all. This is a crazy spawn. Wow, what are the odds, really, guys? Damn. This is crazy, whoa. Alright, we definitely do not have enough space in our inventory now to keep any of this stuff. So, let's see. 
Knockback, mending, I'm breaking. Fire charges. All right, cool. We're just gonna leave that chest right over there. We definitely need to come back here. All right, so let's head back to home first. To base, actually. We're gonna drop off all of our stuff. And we are gonna head to the ravines. And in the next episode, we will link up the nether portals. And yeah, I think that would definitely make traveling time a lot easier. Because I was thinking of putting rails down instead. And yeah, actually to get reels down from one place to another, I think it's actually going to be quite a challenge. As you guys saw from the previous time when I had to transport the villagers. Yeah, that <laughs> didn't really work out well. Yeah, there was a lot of try and error and all that kind of stuff going into it. So yeah, I don't really like the whole idea of traveling with reels anymore. Except for the one that is near our base and connect and that connecting to the, the village that was near our base as well. So yeah, I didn't do it. If it's like a few hundred blocks out, I don't think I'll ever do that again. I would not recommend it. <laughs> because, yeah, it's just too tedious. But maybe in the future, we'll see how it goes. Alright, so let's head back to base first. I'll see you guys in just a bit. After we drop our stuff, we are going to head to the ravines for mining, for mining adventure. Yes. So let's do that. Alright, see you guys in just a bit. Where are they? Where's the ravine that I found the other time? I mean, it's just, just now. So weird. I think it's here. Should have ah there yeah, there we go. Should have marked it. I should mark it right. Should be around now. All right, cool. So we found a ravine. I think this is the deepest one. I actually went around the area to scout for different ravines and i think this is actually our best option so just gonna make this place pretty prominent so that we know this is the entrance to the ravine uh honestly if we see this tree and we still do not know that that's the ravine i think something's wrong with us all right <laughs> all right cool so we've got to be extra careful as we proceed down this way uh yeah we have a couple of few in the area with uh, yeah i think i i found like another tree with one small tiny one yeah, so that's a, that was a little bit weird. But uh, it's all good. Okay, cool. So let's uh, make our way down now. We're just gonna clear the vicinity. And uh, it's always good to have extra building blocks. Alright, so that's where our entrance will be, right? So actually, you know what? Let's start from here instead. I think we, it will be a lot easier for us. Yeah, just gotta be extra careful as we make our way down now. Because we definitely do not want to fall off the edge. Yeah, see? Alright, cool. It's gonna make like a like a spiral type thing. Ooh. Yo, alright. Thankfully we didn't dig straight down, but uh I think we can now. So let's do that. But let's still be extra careful as we proceed. Because yeah, we definitely do not want to have anything happen to us, right? Gonna keep that there. Yeah, alright, let's do that. Right, it's gonna make a turn right over here. Gonna proceed down this way. It's gonna light it up once in a while. You know what? Let's put the shoe away first. All right, I hear. Okay, that's the. I hear water, so that's great. All right, got some coal as well, so don't mind if I do. And I hear zombies already. Great. So we are actually currently at Y forty eight. So we we are some ways down. Got to go about 33 blocks downwards, yeah, to hit diamond level. I like to dig around Y15. I think that's a lucky number for me. Yeah, why is it so weird now? So I duck. Does this need to go? Wait a minute. Yeah, uh, here. Nope. That. There. All right. All right. Cool. It's gonna carry off. Yes. All right. There we go. I hear water. So, gotta be extra careful now. I think we are reaching the ravines. Alright, there we go. Yeah, okay, we've touched bottom. Rock bottom. Not really rock bottom, but yeah, alright. Uh, we're just gonna get rid of this water source. So that, uh, you know what, uh, I don't really want to destroy it. So, just gonna do something about it. Maybe something like that. I think this works, just to... Cordon it off. Why are you not stopping? Alright, there we go. Cool. Alright, just gotta be extra careful now. So that we do not break the water stream. Or break any blocks that will cause the water stream to move down. 
It's gonna take some more coal. And always change this into coal blocks. If you guys do not have enough storage, that will definitely be the better option. Rather than discarding some of the unwanted coal. Yeah, alright, cool. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, nice, nice. Alright. I keep saying nice, I don't know why, but yeah, okay. Whoa! No! <laughs> is it? This is a ravine and a ravine. Whoa! What? No, no. This is mad. Guys, whoa! <laughs> I am in awe. Wow, what is this? This is crazy. Okay, it's turning night time. We gotta be. Okay, we gotta be extra careful now. Um, okay, there's a skeleton right over there. So, let's get ready to fight this guy. Don't mind if I do. Didn't mean to put more than four torches down. Is that an Aravine? No way, guys. Whoa, this is mad. Wow. This is really insane. Alright, let's light up the area so that nothing spawns. I hear a skeleton. This is mad, guys. This is probably one of the best caves that I've ever came across. I mean, I came across a few when I was mining off camera to get more diamonds, but yo. I, I mean, this is just mad. This is really just mad. Alright, um, just gonna place a few more torches down so that nothing spawns and nothing drops over our head as we proceed down. Uh, we've gotta make our, our walkway super obvious so that we know which way is back up. Just gonna light up the area. We gotta make it be known to ourselves that this is the way that we came down by. Um, this is our stairway. Cool. Alright, um, now comes the question. Should we head down? Actually, you know, I think we should. Yes, I think we definitely should. Okay, cool. Uh, we definitely need more torches. So, we gotta make some. Alright, let's, uh, let's use this space for now. Um, yeah. Cool. We've, we've got to need some sticks. So let's go for eight of them. Boom, boom. This should suffice for now. Let's uh, make our way back down. Okay, how should we actually do this? Hmm, some iron. I, I really want the iron. All right, let's get the iron. Let's be extra careful so that we do not drop all the way down. Here, a zombie. Just gonna light this place up too. All right, let's dig in woods. I think that would be the safer option, right? Just gonna do this once again. We are currently at Y28, so this makes 27. So we need to go down 14 blocks, yeah. Cool. Let's make a turn and face this way so that we can see whether we are at the end of the ravine, so to speak. We are currently at 20, so 19, 18, 17. Nice. 16 and 15 all right we are officially at the level where i'm most used to finding some diamonds so that's definitely great we gotta be extra careful now because we are very near lava and i believe there are many mobs around us so yes we've got to be extra extra careful here guys all right great stone nice um yeah just gotta break that and head down this way Alright, cool. So this is the part where we be extra extra careful now. Uh, so we'll do this. Oh, diamond! Alright, we found some, some extra diamonds already. That's great. Alright, let's spread the floor. <laughs> Gotta uh, light up the area as well. So that nothing spawns near us. Yeah. Just want to be extra safe and extra careful, you know. And never be too sure these days. Yeah. Just let's, let's just light it up. This is ah look see see what I mean guys <laughs> look 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 at that you guys saw you guys saw that right okay I did not mean to fire that shot but let me show you guys what was looking around the corner there we go you see you see that you see that sly 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 monster yeah it's gonna briefly destroy him nope I did not mean for that. It's gonna nope we out get away all right nice so this is why you really want to light up all the caves that you're in so that you prevent things like this from happening just in case they drop down you know especially if you're playing in ultra hardcore <laughs> so that's definitely gonna help save your life 
Trust me when I say it. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's uh mine around. Oh, this is pretty dope. It's like a ravine and a ravine. Damn, I I don't think I've ever seen this ever in like mine um in my years of playing Minecraft. Yeah, this is pretty dope. I I'm really liking it a lot. Like like a lot a lot. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, turn some more of these lava into obsidian so that we can move around safely and so that we can start mining just a little bit more efficiently as well. We've got some diamond right over here. We've got to be extra careful with um, what we have and what we have to deal with. Obsidian is always the best option. Alright, so it looks like we have two diamonds at the moment. We've got some more lava from there. Sometimes if you don't really want to, you know, use the... Oh. <laughs> I was saying, uh, if you do not want to use water to do with the lava sauce, you can always place down blocks. As such, so that... Yeah, you can prevent the lava from moving around. But yeah, we're just going to leave that one be. Alright, no, yes. See, this is this is why you got to be extra careful, because you never know what's lurking around the corners. Alright, so... Let's go get rid of that as well. Alright, this looks like a two vein. I think. Let's um I don't really want to turn this into Okay, something just Whoa, okay. Nice. Alright, uh, let's just be extra careful. I know I've been saying it a lot, but yes, we really gotta be extra careful. Because I too many experiences with having to do with um lava and honestly not a very big fan of lava. Clearly am not. Let's uh, get rid of this obsidian as well. Alright, cool. So we are actually dealing with a two vein. So let's just go ahead with that. With the fortune pickaxe that we have. Fortune tree. We should have three of these. Five. Whoa, okay. I'll take it from two. Alright, that's pretty good. Alright, uh, we are currently at Y level 11. So yeah, let's continue to explore the area just a little bit more before we decide whether we should end the episode right over here or we can find other caves to find more diamonds yeah all right let's just go around for just a bit and yeah i think that's the plan for now gonna make sure that we turn all of this into obsidian light up the place as well as we move along so dark i don't i don't like working in the dark it's no good for any one of us all right let's keep on moving forward I get so paranoid, I swear. I get super paranoid with this. We just gotta make sure we really try to light up this place as much as we can. Alright, uh, moving forward, moving forward. Let's light it up, let's light it up. Alright, more diamonds, nice! Ooh, I hope uh, we get more this time around. Because uh, we've, we've got five at the moment, which is pretty sizable. But it's always good to have more, right? Alright, I'm gonna take this goal with us as well. This redstone too. Really? Just, just, just that. I'm gonna take the iron. Try not to miss out on any of the ores because they will definitely be useful in time to come. All right. So yeah, just gonna leave the ones in the ceiling be as it is. What is that? Oh, I thought it was a skeleton for a moment. All right. Um, let's do this. Let's light this place up. Iron, redstone. Cool. Alright, uh, let's build like a blockage, so to speak. Alright, that should do the trick. Alright, let's dig into this wall. Really? Okay. <laughs> I thought it was just one. I was like, what? Are you for real now? Alright. Not too bad, not too bad, not too bad. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. let's do that. Always dig the blocks around because... You never know what you might get underneath the surface. Alright, so that includes that block. Just gonna patch it up. That includes going around and making sure that you know what you're dealing with. Alright, so that means uh, this top block is secured. So we're gonna mine that first. We're gonna get rid of that. No, actually, we don't really need to get rid of that. Where is my pickaxe? Where's my pickaxe? Wait, what? 
Is it on the other side? Wait a minute. What? No. What just happened? Wait. Wait. Hold, hold, hold up. Wait. What? Where's my pickaxe? <laughs> oh, shit. No. I don't believe I lost it. Oh, boy. This is bad. No. Nah. -uh. No way. Where is my pickaxe? This is... No. <laughs> Guys. Really now? Really? No. Nah. Nah, I'm not buying this. This is so unfortunate. No way. How? I mean, how? Really, how? Where is my pickaxe? Could it be here somewhere? Let's follow the source of the water. Maybe it will take us there. It's really gone, guys. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about this, but it's okay. We have abundance of netherite back at home, so... Yeah, I guess, I guess we gotta conclude the episode. You know what, let's, uh, let's just make a... Let's just make a... Um, let's just make a diamond pickaxe. We're gonna collect whatever's left, okay? And then we're just gonna head back up and... Back to base and conclude the episode over there. Wow, I can't believe it. We actually lost. No, it's back. What? Okay, this is super weird. Okay. <laughs> what an episode. Okay, this is... Wow, okay. I... You know what? Uh, Yeah, let's just leave that there. Alright, good. Just mind this and conclude the episode. Whoa, that was super spooky. Alright. There we go. We have a total of 13 diamonds now from 5 blocks, which is a pretty decent size. I must say, we can always come back to the ravine uh, in time to come. Yeah, I don't even know whether it's nighttime or daytime right about now, but yeah. Okay, I honestly had have no idea how we actually, like, or rather how my, my netherite pickaxe disappeared. That, that was super weird, but I guess it's just some Minecraft things, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, uh, I think it's daytime somewhere. Yeah, probably daytime. We're just gonna make our way back up. Yeah, it's just daytime. Alright, cool. Um, definitely gonna make this entrance super obvious as well. So we've gotta dig a super big hole so that when we come back, we know that this is the spot that we have to enter from to find the ravine in the ravine. Yeah. That was super weird, right? I mean, it's not just me. Is it just me that found that weird? That there was a, like a bug type thing? No. Where are my torches now? Did I discard all of them? You know what? <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm just gonna make this entrance super super obvious right now. Just gonna use some cobblestones to demarcate the area. So we came up by this way. We went up there as well. Just gonna do this. So that it sticks out like a saw thumb, so to speak. I'm not gonna lie, I got I got pretty nervous. I was like, whoa, where's my pickaxe? <laughs> That's so funny and so weird. Alright, cool. This is definitely gonna be an eyesore from the top. Alright, cool. I think this is pretty obvious where the uh, this entrance is gonna be at. Yeah. I think that's really pretty obvious. Alright, that's our stairway as well, so that's Make it a little bit more accessible. Uh, we don't really want to explore that area today. We're gonna head back to base. We're gonna drop off all our all of our stuff. All oh, <laughs> we're gonna head back to base. We're gonna drop off all of our stuff, and we're gonna conclude the episode back at home. And yeah, in the next episode, we've got to find a way to make sure that we link up the Nether portals together so that we will have an easier time. Getting around from one portal to another, or from one village to the other. Gotta let me do some work here so that we do not fall over. And gonna break that. We are gonna break this. That, 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 that. Right there. Just gonna put that back there. Um, Here, 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 here. And that. Alright, cool. Alright, nice. Pretty nice stairway leading downwards. Okay, so now we've gotta find a direction to go back home. Um, this way. All right, let's go. Uh, me, I will meet you guys back. At, all right, we're just gonna travel back to base. Uh, so 
If there's anything interesting, I'll cut to that. Probably we'll, let's let's fight the pillagers as we make our way back. I think uh, it will be good for us to get the extra EXP. Yeah, I mean, why not, right? <laughs> Since we we are on our way. All right, let's go. See the pillagers right over there. So just gonna go there, take them out, and head back to base. All right, we're here. I think they spot us. They spot us. Yes, 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 yes. All right, cool. Let's get it. Nope, I missed my first two hits and more. Come on, bring it. Critical hit, nice. Alright, who's next? Oh. Alright, take that. Lift the knockback. You too. One more hit. Nope, that was weak. Alright, nice. Yo, you guys are everywhere today. Just casually shoot each other, please. Nice. Easy stuff. And burn. Nice. Just gonna eat up. So there was five of them. I think that's all. We've got the guy with the banner just now. Uh, I mean, I, I saw the guy with the banner, so... <laughs> oh, am I hitting them with the pickaxe? There you go. Bye bye. Let's be extra careful. I'm not the best fighter, so I really gotta train. There we go. Critical. Okay, that's good. Just bam. Yo, they're just spawning everywhere now. Nice. I'm telling you guys, if it's not for the armor, I would have been dead like seconds ago. Alright, give me that enchanted pickaxe. Uh, kick pickaxe, wow! Give me the enchanted crossbow. I need it. No, they didn't drop it. He didn't drop it. I think this will be the last guy. Oh, crap. I did not mean for that to happen. Let's dig our way out. Oh, there's another guy right over here. Uh. Yeah, let's just take this one out as well. And we will head back to base. Alright. Easy stuff. Easy, easy stuff. Alright, let's head back to base. In the next episode, probably we will also get... Okay, let's just make a run now. Uh, in the next episode, we're probably gonna get some horses as well. Actually, just one. Because we only have a, one saddle, right? I think it's just one saddle. So, I think that will definitely help us with the... Why is this guy still chasing me? Okay, Um, as I was saying, we're gonna get some horses. Alright, just one horse because we only have one saddle, right? So that would definitely help with the traveling part of the game. Other than just the nether portals and whatnot. Yeah, I think the horse will definitely help increase the efficiency level of our traveling time as well. So yeah, probably gonna find one horse that's super good. And yeah, we're just gonna go with that horse for the rest of this series. Yeah. I think that's a pretty good plan. Yeah. Alright, so we can see our base. That's our greenhouse. Our beloved greenhouse. And our mob spawner. Yeah. So, yeah. Pretty close to home. Pretty great stuff. Uh, yeah. I think that's pretty much it for today's episode, actually. So, let's just go ahead and conclude it right over here. So, once again. Whoa. <laughs> Won't you look at that? Alright, let me get let me get up here. And do this before the sun gets down. Alright, so we are back at base, so we're gonna conclude the episode right over here. Wow, would you look at all these battle scars, all these arrows in me. <laughs> Alright, cool. So, thanks so much for tuning in to episode number 16 of the Survival Let's Play series. It has been super fun playing this episode, so I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. So, yes, please remember to subscribe to the channel. Please remember to like this video as well. It will definitely, definitely help the growth of the channel, so please do do that. And let me know what you guys like about this video in the in the comment section down below. <laughs> so, so many epic moments today. So uh, yeah, losing the pickaxe, uh, fighting the pillagers and all that kind of shenanigans. And finding so many nether portals and another desert temple actually. So yeah, that's pretty, pretty dope. Alright, so with that, I hope you guys stay safe. Take care of yourselves as the sun goes down. I would like to wish you guys a happy weekend ahead. And yeah, have a good one guys. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.